A nationwide lifeguard shortage is leading to delayed pool openings and booming swim lessons. News Channel 5's Alexander Cohen talked with the owner of Safe Splash Swim School about this situation. Empty lifeguard stands sit at several community pools. According to Olympic gold medalist Davis Tarwater, he's had trouble finding lifeguards for his safe splash swim schools. We're hearing reports of, you know, summer uh, pools that have had to close down and even in our staffing of lifeguards, it's it's been difficult. Um, we have the ability to train them in house, but we've had a very hard time during the pandemic. Some training and certification courses were canceled working with a with a buddy working with a in a group class environment. So um, and then a lot of pools were not open for a period of time. So there was a crunch in the lifeguard market that is now coming full circle. Since there is a national shortage of lifeguards, it makes parents feel safer to have swim lessons, which is why they've been so busy here at this swim school. I may be ready. Maeve and Guinevieve love to swim. Their mom, Colette Rodriguez, watches intently. So I wanted to make sure my kids were safe. I also think that when you teach kids new skills, it empowers them. She says they go to several unguarded pools. So that's why these skills are important. When you're at a public pool, I've seen attendants just being on their phones, not paying attention, and that happened in the last few weeks. As their swim lesson came to an end, Colette hopes lifeguard stands will be filled soon for safety reasons. It, all it takes is a second to not be paying attention, and if they think they're fearless in the water, that's when bad things happen. Reporting in Nashville, Alexandra Cohen, News Channel 5.